with zero warning on a warm day in the summer of 2024 when I went to flush my Thetford toilet and pressed the blue button, nothing happened. No whirlpool of water swirling down into the cassette and no pump noise. I reckon this is one of those simple jobs that are made difficult because the design is considered more important than the ability to repair, a classic case of form over function. Step one was to check that I had power coming out of the fuse box, which I did. Step two was to check that I had power arriving at the toilet flush control circuit by removing the handle and generally easing the cover out. The control circuit is on the underside of the cover and there was no incoming power. Step three was to put a new fuse into the Thetford's ridiculously positioned inline fuse socket which is halfway along on the rear wall of the cassette cave. The C402 comes with a cassette removable from right or left ends depending on which version you buy so positioning the fuse box at arm's length of both ends makes it inconvenient whichever option you go for. Why not make it accessible from the front or top, I ask. At this point, I had power coming into the control circuit board. Step four was to check if the power was leaving the circuit board to the pump. This is an amusing challenge for one person as you have to press the blue button whilst holding the pins of the voltmeter in place. I had power going to the pump, but the pump was not working, so time to replace it. Firstly though, I drained the flush tank reservoir. I then removed the teardrop shaped tray and fought bravely with pipe and cable to remove the pump from its nesting place down in the bottom of the flush tank reservoir. Design fail number two for me, the decorous teardrop shape of the water seal tray provided an orifice that would have allowed an 11 year old easy access to the pump but with my big hands it was a ridiculous struggle. I lost some skin in the game and the toilet lost the wire connections to the control circuit. A new pump was duly ordered from Grasshopper Leisure who I have used before and the replacement pump arrived within days. Wiring the new pump was relatively simple despite having pulled the wires out of the board. Positioning it in the reservoir required more hand scraping but was the job of less than a minute. It's all good. 